at a shift for gold, 104.3, just in Melton with Connor Rogers. Yeah, nice little drive up. The traffic wasn't too awful, even though I came up at 8.30 in the morning. Yep. Out in Melton, trying to give away some Toyotas. So let's uh, let's rip in. Here with the great man Rog on another shift. I reckon this is two shifts in three weeks together. Dude, can you believe it? I missed your face. It's good to see you. <laughs> um, what are we doing today? We're giving away a car, mate. The brand new Toyota uh, High Earth. I don't know the first thing about cars. My dad was a wholesaler his whole life, and. Uh, I was too busy finding my way through a box of uh, McDonald's family value to uh, worry about selling cars. Did you get any tips off Scotty Rodge? Yep, he told me uh, when you're about to put a girl away, make sure you always wear a condom. If it's not on, it's not on. Well, that's great advice. Yes. And oh, I'll... you're talking about the car? <laughs> oh, the I, car. I think that'll help us in this situation oh, yeah. as well. The shift is done and dusted. Trade deadline day. Are the blues going to get papily? Just the fourth woman today. I don't know. I'm busy tonight. It's trade deadline day. What are you get? Oh, fuck, are we on camera? Yeah, oh, we, we are, we are, yeah. yeah. trade deadline day. Pathway to the Blue Baggers, um, Jack Martin, and Mark Pitney will win the flag. That's a flag uh, lineup if I've ever seen one. Green Premiership, <laughs> three of them as well. Just got a couple of things to do in the office, but uh, lunchtime, as we know how it is here on the vlogs, I've got a grilled chicken wrap and a cappuccino, small cap, so... Um, the grilled chicken wraps here up in Richmond on Bridge Road at the Short Black Cafe are as good as it gets. Couldn't recommend any higher. My shift has ended, done and dusted. Yeah, the, uh, the wrap and the coffee went down an absolute treat. So now just gonna trek home, just tossing up between Trade Radio, uh, some podcasts or my Spotify to listen to on the trek home. But um, yeah, look, I'll just take that decision one second at a time and I'll make what's best for me and my road trip, I guess. Just about to film a video about Michael Jackson's fans. I've been through Instagram and some of the accounts of that crook, so gonna make a video about it now and hopefully it'll be out soon. Just got back from the show, smashed a roll. Got a, another coffee, second coffee for the day, but I've gone uh, decaf mode, just to be safe and sound. Got the M&M uh, show bag. I didn't want a show bag, but you can't really go to the show and not get a show bag. But um, yeah, just been a cruisy week. Sunday Arvo, I might do a bit of editing and then hop on Fortnite with the boys. I haven't played the new season yet, so that's what we'll get up to today. It is 30 degrees today, gang. I'm uploading a video of Michael Jackson. I've got a bit of a, uh, a vid on the King of Pop, just taking the piss out of a couple of Instagram uh, pages that I saw. But it is ice long black time, I would have thought. So let's go up and uh, indulge. Look at the weather. Scenes here at Torquay. Got an ice long black. I'm a massive fan of ice long blacks with a touch of milk, which everyone is probably saying, well, that's an ice latte, but an ice latte I feel like is a lot more milkier than what I do here. This is basically an ice long black. Just, it's like watery AF. It's just got a little bit of milk just to smoothen it out. Finished uploading my Michael Jackson video. Something a little bit different on the channel, which is what I'm keen to do over the summer. Just mix up a lot of my content. And um, yeah, it might be like a little bit of a surprise. I'm doing a video on Michael Jackson fans' Instagram accounts, but um, I don't know. I find humor in a lot of things other than footy. So I want to mix it up over the summer. I feel like this and the takeaway chips video and um, a couple of the other videos that are coming up will be a good, yeah, a good little experiment to see uh, see how versatile I can be. So. Oh, here with Rog on another shift. Glorious day here in Ringwood. How are we traveling, big man? Oh, I've never been better, McDonald. The sun's out, I'm with me best mate, and uh, there's only one thing that could make this better. Hot cross buns. Nah, uh, just by sitting back and watching Steve Smith make a really cruisy century. That's what I really enjoy doing right now. Just got back from my shift with Connor the Rogers, Rogers the Great. And um, just about to go down to JB Hi-Fi. I, I want to get a gimbal. Yeah, the, uh, big, uh... Um, yeah, I was using one at Kiss FM and they're unreal. And I also want to get a vlogging cam so I can stop vlogging on my phone. JB Hi-Fi, provide the goods, my friend.
long, long time ago, I did some eight ball pool content. Was honestly the peak of my YouTubing career, really. This time I've come back to the eight ball pool game and I'm ready to step up the stakes. I am going to bet 100,000 eight ball pool coins in a one-on-one -on -one match to try and win. Now this is a lot of coins. I have been playing this game for months on end, trying to slowly but surely work up the amount of coins that I have in this game. I'm gonna bet them all in one single match. I've never bet this much money in a game of eight ball pool before, so I have no idea how this is gonna go. But yeah, high stakes, high rewards. So I'm gonna be doing it for you guys. Let's go. There's only one thing left to do though. I don't think I can compete in this attire. Like it doesn't make sense. So I'm gonna get my kit on. All right, now I'm ready. I'm going to play eight ball pool with 100,000 coins on the line. 10 ounce glove, no head guards either, and it's gonna be live across the zone. You can see I've got 100,000 coins that I've worked up. Oh God, oh golly gosh. All right, it's finding me an opponent. Come on, McDonald, if you've ever had to come through before, today's the day. All right, he's kicking off. And what a shot, he's potted one. What's he doing? What's he doing here? What's he doing that for? That was delicate. 200,000 coins is on the line here. He's got the first. He's hit every ball in so far. Get him white. Oh. Imagine if I don't even get a chance to hit. <laughs> he's working it out very, very well early here at the G. He's only got three balls left. Oh my God. This red one's on. This is easy. He's making light work of me. He's only got two balls left. <laughs> danger signs, danger signs here at the G. This yellow, it's not impossible either, is it? It's not impossible. He's got one ball left. <laughs> oh, you're kidding me. I haven't had a shot yet. This would be the worst video ever if I don't get a shot. He's going for the blue. He's got the blue. Can, can we snooker him? I think he's snookered. So he's going for the win. I haven't had a shot yet. 200,000 coins on the line. He's going for the win. If he misses this, I'm going to have to pot everyone to win. What's he going to do? This, this is impossible. This would be a joke if he gets it. He's missed. I have to pot every ball to win. I have to pot every ball to win. I'm nervous, man. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I must pot every ball. That's a good start. That is a good start. Come on. Come on, McDonald. I'm just going this corner again. <sighs> Must pot every ball to win. All right. I'm actually nervous AF. This is ridiculous. Delivered that one. Delivered that one. Should we start working this side a little bit more? I think that's what I'll do. I'll pot the perp. I'll pot the, uh, the Damien Barrett, the purple warrior. This is the comeback of the century. Must pot this one. Come on, McDonald. Straighten that up a bit. Straighten her up. Running out of time. Shoots. Oh, no. This for the win. 200 clams. McDonald's choked here at the G. 200 clams. 200,000 clams. Don't bet. Never bet.